What's up, Mentorship Freaks? It's the Daily Dose, a little later than usual, of the Mentorship Motivator. We're talking about Monday. It's Monday. It's about 5, 5, 6, 6, 15 p.m. on the east. So that's, what is that, 3 p.m. for you palm tree time zone people. We're talking about Mondays. Mondays. Monday, first of all, Monday's my favorite day of the freak of week. If it's not yours and you're doing something wrong, like all weekend, you're just itching. Even though you might be getting some work done on the weekend, Sunday might be your, your rest day if you even believe in those in the gym, whatever it is. You, things might be a little different on the weekend, some, not as much business being done, but you're still working, you're still getting shit done. But you just can't wait to get to Monday because that's when the world wakes up so you can go and attack the day. So I want to talk about Mondays, how to make Monday your bitch, how to own your freaking Monday, which is going to help you own your week and set the tone for the week. Because Mondays set the tone for the week. The first thing to do is always get a close on a Monday. Get a new deal on a Monday. Get it. Get it done. For us, that means closing a twelve-month, a twelve-month program with a client. Uh, wanna, you know, always make sure you get a new one on Monday because then it just sets that men- mentality for the week. Also, sell a good amount of sell some trials on a Monday. Get a referral on a Monday. Get a new lead on a Monday. Get a review on a Monday. For us, sell some products, which is our supplements and clothing, on a Monday. Do all that. Make sure do not leave. The Monday until you get, you know, make your list of what it is in your business of closing a deal and then all those other different sales. That just sets the tone for the week. You're like, fuck yeah, I just own this bitch and I'm going to, I'm going to now going to build on that momentum for the week. Imagine if you do none of that on a Monday. Now it's just like, all right, you just lost one seventh of the freaking week, whatever that is, 13%. I don't even know what the hell number that is and whatever. So then also what about this? Create a video on a Monday, create some content on a Monday. Create content, write something, record something, do a live video, create on a Monday. You'll just feel like you get a week's worth of shit. You just hit these bullet points. Have your meetings. Have quick, clear, productive meetings on a Monday. All meet. All meet. And finish on a good note of the meetings and feel good after the meeting. Like you just accomplished something. Like even if you don't meet for the rest of the week. That it was such a a, a full of just meat and and needle-moving discussion and activities that you wouldn't even need to meet for the rest of the week if you needed to. So think about that. Quick, clear, productive meetings. Then have a sales meeting on a Monday. We do our sales training every Monday. It's two hours. And I always have our sales consultants schedule their consultations as soon as possible right after that meeting. So our meeting ends at 2.30 p.m. So they are scheduled by 3 p.m., 4 p.m., 5 p.m. Imagine you can lock those down because you're going with that stuff fresh in your head. You just practice it. You just role played it. It's going to be fresh. It's like boom, boom, boom. If you have any gap in that time, that's the time to call up leads right after that sales meeting because this stuff is fresh in your freaking head and just hit the phones to schedule your consultations. So that's the next thing to do on a Monday. Schedule at least five appointments for the week. Now, of course, you have admin you should have an administrative assistant that's scheduling appointments for you but literally yourself schedule for yourself an additional five appointments just so you know i have at least even if my admin did nothing was useless i have at least five appointments i closed a deal today i made all these sales today and i have at least another five set for the week minimum regardless of what your admin does so it's in your it's in your hands then you know Again, speed of implementation on all that. Do that stuff right after the sales training because it's going to be fresh in your head. Those ideas are going to be fresh in your head. Then learn something every Monday. Learn something new and something new and specific and then practice it and even use it in the same day. Imagine this is all, these are all little tiny things, but they're big fucking things and combined together. It's just momentum, building momentum for the freaking week. And then plan to ride that this wave of Monday as hard as you can. Now, that's just setting the momentum. Think the rest of the week, you should be still killing it, obviously. This is just to get the ball rolling for Monday and that snowball effect and just fucking go hard until Friday. Learn something new every day. Of, of course, learn something new on Monday. Start with that every day. Make the sale. Get a review. Get a referral. Sell a trial. And then you get to Friday. Run it hard to Friday. On Friday, you know what you do? You know when Monday really starts? It doesn't start on the weekend. It doesn't start Sunday with planning. Your Monday starts on fucking Friday. So on Friday, you're going to try to do everything you did on Monday. Close at least one deal. Close a deal. Sell a trial for us. You know, relate this to your business. Sell some products, get a review, get a referral, get a lead, and then schedule five more appointments for the following week. So that gives you a total, a minimum of 10 appointments for yourself that you did yourself 
even if no one else does anything else for you, you're just going to be set. So you set five on Friday. You get in Monday. You're going to have your sales meeting. You're going to set another five. You're going to get that close on Friday, that close on Monday. It's like unbeatable. You're bookending your week with just success, victory, fucking motivation, and just domination. That's what you're going to do. Make the sales. And then also on that Friday, you're going to confirm your appointments for that upcoming week. On Monday, you're going to reconfirm all those appointments for the upcoming week yourself. So you can start building the rapport with those people that you're going to be meeting with. And then you're going to obviously do those, have those at minimum of 10 sales appointments. Monday is your secret to success. It's the secret to a, a dominant week. It sets a tone for the week. Build up on momentum, momentum. Kill it on a Monday. It's Monday now. Did you kill it Monday? Were you excited about this Monday today? You better have been. If not, we need to talk. Attack your fucking Monday. Make it your bitch. I will talk to you later. You are freaking awesome. No excuses.